What's going on everyone? Builder Tracer MC here. And today I just want to preface this video saying, wait a minute, this title screen looks very unfamiliar. Yes, I have tried to record this before. That was a long time ago, but it's it's coming back, but there's one little thing that's kind of wrong with this series um coming back. Uh this is Terraria, obviously, as you can see, and basically this is a game where it's kind of like 2D Minecraft, but it's so much more, and you'll see through the gameplay, but the sad part about this is, um, I might, I may or may not, if this video gets, like, a bunch of dislikes or whatever, I might or so, because I have a lot of series going now, I might have to end, I'm sorry about this, but I might have to end the Call of Duty series, uh, for two reasons. One, um, I could not get my screen in the 1080p, which means if I ever did a Call of Duty episode ever again, it'd be the same quality as the one I posted, which is, like, only half the screen, which is kind of annoying. And the second thing is, whenever I did post that, uh, that kind of that, uh, first video of, uh, Call of Duty campaign, it didn't really get too much hype. Like, it didn't, um, it didn't get as much hype as my normal videos. So, whenever I get that kind of feedback, I just, um, kind of infer or assume that, um, not many people like it and they like Minecraft style games better. So, that's why I came up with this series, Terraria. And this is, yes, a longer preference than usual. Just to say I'm sorry about Call of Duty, if you were like one of the two, one or two people that did like the video and wanted campaign, I might post a few of those, um, very rarely, or maybe if I wanted to bring it back after this got boring, which will probably not, but anyways, if you want campaign back and just scrap this, then, um, uh, just leave it in the comments, but I don't think they, not many people want it back, I think like one or two do. But those of you that kind of, um, didn't really get much hype from that video, like, just saw, oh, Call of Duty campaign, I don't really like shooting games, so I didn't really click on that, but, uh, that's why I'm uploading this, so, so if you guys don't like this, anyways, I'm rambling for too long, but if you guys don't like this, just leave a, a like, just ignore it, and I will know to go back to campaign, so, anyways, see you guys in the gameplay, hopefully you like it, see you guys, and, like, Literally a second or maybe even half a second. See you guys in the video. How's it going everyone? Builder Chaser MC here. And I already said that twice, but today, um, I am starting a new series, but if you watch the preference, you'd know the bad news about this series just to let you know. Anyways, this series it's called Terraria. I explained this game just a tad in the preference, but I'm eating another sweetheart, don't worry about it. Anyways, um like I said in the preference, that w that has to happen because I do have a lot of series um going at the same time. But off that subject, today we are playing some Terraria, and this will be episode one. Just give me your feedback on what you think of this video. If I don't get much hype from it, I'll go back to Call of Duty, like I said in the preference. But anyways, let's create a character. I already have two created, but I'm not gonna mess with these guys yet. They look really sick, but I'm not. They are nothing to do with the series, okay? Nothing to do with it. So let's create a character. Okay. So let's go with our hair. Um, I will see you guys back because not many people like this cr character creating stuff. Um, I'll just show you what the character looks like when I'm done creating it. See you guys in probably ten minutes because I have to have everything perfect. All right, the character has been created, and as you can see. This is kind of what I look like in real life, if you guys don't know. Um, these, uh, the clothes that my character has on right now is kind of the, um, the kind of clothes I am wearing now. I'm kind of wearing, uh, like, blue sweatpants and a red shirt. I don't know how that matches anywhere near correctly, but it doesn't. So that's what we're gonna wear here, and I have brown hair and green eyes, so I did that. Let's create. And we're gonna name this puppy Builder. I already came up with the name Builder. YT, uh, no, no, space, YT, there we go, Builder YouTube, so I know this is the create character, the, uh, the right character, actually, so let's go to Builder YT, uh, these are all my worlds for other, my other two characters, so let's create a world, we're gonna go with a medium world, just so it's not large or small, and then we're gonna go with, uh, y uh YT for this title, just because, and, uh, yes, we're just gonna go with that, and I, um, I'm not even going to pause this loading screen. There's so many loading screens and so many games I play that that take ages to load. I know if I did a small world, though, this would only take half the time, but I don't really think that's too worth it anyway. So, actually, guys, um, 
I have been watching this, um, I guess you could say small ta uh, small town YouTuber lately. Um, I'm kind of giving him a shout out because I kind of like his videos. I think he's up to 57 subs now. Congratulations on uh, 50 subs, by the way. But his name is XX Creepy XX, and um, I may or may not leave his link in the description below. I don't know though. I don't know if I will or not because I I have a very horrible memory, but. Um, he actually has been posting some pretty good videos lately, and, um, I actually wanted to, uh, because if XXFreeBoy actually found this video, which he probably won't, but, um, I kind of wanted to do, um, a little video or something with him, I have no idea, I'm just putting my dreams out into the world right now, but, uh, I'm not saying that he's, like, the most popular YouTuber in the world, I'm just saying he has some pretty good, um, videos. So yes, um, I might actually leave a comment on one of his videos. So let's get into the Terraria gameplay, and here we go. Once it settles the liquids, we are good to go. Alright, here we go. So let's zoom our map out a little bit and then bounce it. Alright, so what do we get? We got a copper short sword, a uh, sharp copper pickaxe, and an annoying axe. Come on, man. Okay, so let's, um... The reason that I actually came up with the idea for this series is a very specific reason. I actually had been playing some Terraria uh, PS4, PlayStation 4 edition, a lot lately. So, um, I have had Terraria PC for a while, as you can tell with those characters I showed you in the beginning. But beside that reason, I wanted to do a PC series on, um... Wait, no, I wanted to do a Terraria series on PC, that's what I meant. And I have a pretty good character on PS4, anyways. So I wanted to um, do that, and I've defeated a couple bosses. Because as you'll see through the gameplay, this game is so in-depth, it has so many bosses, and you'll just see through the gameplay how good this game really is. And I can prove it to you, because I put over, I think, 100 hours into it. Maybe 150. But um, you'll just see through the gameplay how good this really is. And um, once again, I'll cut this out. Um, I will, like, fast forward to the part where I have enough wood, pretty much, so I can, uh, build some stuff. So let me go over here and grab some more wood, and I will see you guys when I have, like, a couple hundred wood. Alright, I'm back for the third time, and, um, I have just over 300 pieces of wood. So I'm actually gonna use some of this wood real quick, uh, to build a little bridge across to here. Okay, and I actually did see a cave, oh, ooh, ooh, copper, copper, copper. Okay, anyways, uh, I got distracted. I did see a little bit of a cave um, over here uh, in this direction. So let me just get, scrap this dirt. Okay, so I did see a cave over in this direction. I think I saw a chest. I'm not positive, though. I think it was over here by the guide, I'm pretty sure. Okay, yeah, there's. Uh, is there a chest in there? Is there a chest? Is there a chest? Um, No, I don't think so, actually. Thought I saw a chest when I passed by here. Uh, let's destroy this. We're out of that. Okay. Let me destroy this last base, and then I think we'll be good to start um making some stuff. So first we need to make our workbench. Uh, now we can start crafting some necessities like uh torches. I don't know why I gave it that uh, long um. Uh, what should I call it? Like a long leading up to kind of thing. Okay, so let's craft some armor here first. Is that's like the top thing because these the mobs in this game are like ridiculous and they can kill you easily. And we're gonna make a wooden sword which is better than my sword that I have now because I've nimble on it. So uh, speed. Now I'm gonna grab a hammer because I needed that to destroy furniture whenever I play some. Now I need to find cobblestone which is right here right here and then i think in this episode what i want to accomplish i don't know why i'm saying this now it's kind of late now but um i'm trying to build a house uh if you don't know how the housing system in this game works basically what you do is you have to have a uh they give you like a rubric kind of thing that you have to follow and then what i want to do is i want to get uh build a house to make my guide move in, which is, I have to follow the rubric or necessities for a house, pretty much. Like, I need to have a table, a chair, crafting table, walls, torches, lights, anything that's like a necessity, I have to put in the house in order for him to move in. So, yes, that's my main goal of this episode, is to move in 
the guide. And I need to throw some rope down here so I can climb back up. There we go. Okay. Now we need to start um making some furniture real quick. Because I don't want to be making the furniture uh, when I'm done building the house. I just want to have it handy. Oh, I can make the furnace real quick as well. Let me make that. I'm going to need that later. And then I need to open up the window. Go right to torches. Craft as many as I can. Open up the window again. And, uh, okay. So we need to make the necessities. We need to make, I think I'm going to have two doors. Uh, a table. Because these are all the necessities you need. You, like, you need these. Like, the, you can't move anyone unless you have these. I need two chairs. Um, what else do you need? And then uh, walls. And then let's make a. Oh gosh, what, what's attacking me? Oh, slimes! Get away. Um, yeah, I think we're gonna start building my house right when I finish up making these walls, which go in the background so mobs can't spawn in the house. Uh. Which is actually going to be a pretty cool house. Okay, so we have a hundred walls. Now what we need to do is we need to find a space to build our, um, our, or the start of our house. I'm not saying that this is going to be the house. I'm just saying it's going to be, um, our basic, uh, startup house. So I actually need to get out some materials to, uh, make, a uh, fill in the holes that are trying to block, uh, Black me from building stuff. So I need to get rid of some of this stuff. Um, hold this up. I right, move along here. Break that. And replace it because it's only a half block. Okay. Now we're pretty much set for our house space, which isn't too far from our spawn. So let's clear this out a little bit more. And it's getting night time too, so I need to uh, get this guy in by night. Okay. All right. So let's kill this slime. Kill him. All right. There we go. Now I need to clear out the rest of this until we get to the rope. Uh, no, I'm just going to go to the sunflower, actually. And then fill in most of this. There we go. I'm just going to go down there and fill the rest in. Um, so, yes. Uh, this is kind of boring, actually. But once we get past uh, building my house, uh, we can actually go out um, adventuring and stuff. So I think the first episode will be kind of slow because all we're doing is building my house. But I swear, it'll get better, I promise. So... Let's build, uh, make the startup house here. Uh, let's build this over here. And then make a space for the two doors. Uh, one on each side. Two, three. And then just place these doors. Okay, one on each side. Like so. Now we need to have the walls put in like this so mobs can't spawn in here. Alright. And then these walls basically, they keep stuff out. They help the guide move in. Well, it's a necessity for the guide to move in. But they keep uh, things out and from spawning, like I've said already. But they're, uh, they're, they're, they're necessities for NPCs to move in. So let's place that down. That. And then place our table down over here. Now let's put our furnace here. Alright. Alright. Let's get the torches. More torches. There we go. Now I need to light this place up. Nice. Alright. So I think this is our startup house. Now the guide should move in here. Let me just uh, check. Okay, yeah, this housing is suitable. Let's move him in there. There we go. We got our guide moved in. And he's ready to go. I Well, I mean, come in here, I mean. And then what I'm actually going to do real quick is I'm going to get two campfires and basically what these do is they don't catch stuff on fire or anything they just um whenever i stand near them like i'm in the vicinity which means when i'm in my house i actually regenerate health faster and uh just for style i'm gonna put some tiki torches up on my house there we go this doesn't look too bad actually it is kind of really lit up though i guess that's a good thing so stuff can stay out and then let's make some fence Okay, let's make some fence to put outside here. Oh, the zombies are coming. The zombies are coming. The zombies are coming! Lock the doors! And they can't actually get through doors, just to let you know. Um, so that's a good thing, at least. Okay, let's just slay these guys. Oh, no, they're tough. They're tough. No! I forgot these guys were tough. Tougher than usual, I mean. Alright, that's... This, this guy right here, not the one that just died, but this guy is actually one of the stronger zombies, so I gotta stay away from him. 
to eat a mushroom to regenerate my health a little bit. Now let's put some fence out here. This uh, this does absolutely nothing. I'm just trying to make this look a little nicer. And um, safe in my house. I'm going to end this first episode of Terraria. Um, hope you guys aren't too sad about the Call of Duty th um ending thing. And um, hopefully this guide comes in here by the time I get back one later because I'm probably gonna. Here's the deal with this series, guys. I forgot to mention this in the beginning, but with this series, I, this series is going to have a whole ton of episodes because whenever I build anything, unlike my other series, whenever I build anything, I will always have it on camera because this series is always good to have on camera because there's so many things you can find randomly that are really good. So I want to save those moments for you guys. So don't be surprised if we're on, like, episode 10 by, like, like in two weeks because that'll be, like, Probably what it's going to be because yeah, because that's what I'm going to do. I'm just not going to build anything off camera. Oh, there's Saturn over there. Is that Saturn or Neptune? I don't know. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Terraria. And I'm I'm I am rambling again. Hope you guys enjoy. It. And if you did, be sure to slap that like button with your um your forehead. Right? Is that what I say? Forehead. And um, I will end this off end this video off with a flying eye and a zombie outside my window. See you guys. Let's